Hi everybody, it's Axis. It is February 17th. Uh, it's almost 2.45 and I actually wanted to wish you guys a happy late Valentine's Day because I didn't post anything up on my page for Valentine's Day. So yes, happy Valentine's Day. Hope it was good and if you didn't get to spend time with your loved ones on Valentine's then I hope you get to this weekend during President's Day. Um, I actually made a list of things I want to talk about so I don't ramble so much and so I don't take up so much time because I tried to make this video just now and it took 11 minutes so I was like I need to shorten it a little bit so here's my list. Um, so when it comes to music, uh, last week I actually listened to all of the songs that I've been working on for the past while ever since my first album was finished and I realized that I have, I potentially have like six songs that I could put on my next album, which is really exciting because I only had four on my first album. So, um, and I'm making a goal for this second album of mine. I'm hoping to have it finished before summer hits so that I can really focus on the webcomic when that time comes and so that I can really focus on my music right now so they're, um, so that I'm pay paying complete attention to both and they turn out as good as they both can possibly be. So that is my goal for the second album, but we'll see what happens. Um, oh yes, my hair! I got my hair done! Yay! Uh, I did it red on the top. I was hoping it would be a little bit darker and so was my hairstylist, but disorienting. Um, I really, I still love the color. And then on the bottom, on the bottom, it's like this orangey, this bright red orange color. You can tell the difference if I go like this. Ooh, you can actually really tell the difference when I do that. So yeah. But, oh, I absolutely love it. And I actually took off a few inches because it was, originally it was like down to here. So I chopped off a few inches and it's oh, so nice to have it a little bit shorter, but I still have the length and it looks pretty. So yeah, I just really got that done yesterday and I'm totally digging it. Um, Alright, and then I wanted to show you my art stuff. Um, including the characters that I didn't show you guys last time. Because I remember I was like, avoid showing you my webcomic characters, but I'm going to show them to you. So here we go. Alrighty, so over here is Ray. You can see her name right there. And she's the main character. Um, these are just some random sketches that I was doing of her. I was trying to figure out what kind of face shape to give her, whether it was like oval or more square or almost like more heart shaped. But I actually leaned more towards the square jaw. And I think that might actually be because I have kind of a strong jaw, so maybe that's why, I don't know. I just thought with the thinner jaw she looks kind of funky, so. Um, oh, and then this guy, this is Xander. He's like the main secondary character, if that makes sense. And uh, he is awesome. Ignore this picture, that's all oh, those two, those are ugly. But I like this one. <laughs> And then there was a, a picture last time that I was like, I want to show you this picture. And it was this one down at the bottom. And then it was kind of creepy, gory, but I really liked the shading on it. And sorry about the smearing, by the way, but I actually got new paper in here so it won't smear as much, which is super nice. Moving right along. Oh, sorry, my nose itches. Um, I can't remember if I showed you guys these pages or not, but um, this is Xander again up here. And then the, this was another style practice. I was trying to figure out like how I was going to draw their facial features. And um, this was getting a little too close to the way that anime eyes look. And even these are a little bit, to me they look a little bit anime-esque. So I'm going to try to do something a little bit more realistic. Because I think the, like even though it's more work, it'll be good practice for me. So, that's the style that I'm leaning towards. And let's see. Oh yeah, so this is the page that we left off on. Or that I stopped on last time. 
And this is another style, like, practice, I guess. I'm just trying to feel out what kind of styles are fun to draw and all that. But, um, it was brought to my attention that this picture of Ray actually looks like me. Because my hair is kind of the same, and our facial features are similar, except my eyes obviously aren't that big. Um, so I'm thinking I might do something to change her hair or her her appearance a little bit um, just so that we don't look so similar because I don't um, I don't want to look I don't want my characters to look exactly like me so hopefully that makes sense but yeah because I don't want people to it, like to imagine me being her in the story that's not what I want I want her to be her own identity so moving right along Here's some random pictures. This one is actually one I drew of myself. And these are just some really quick gesture drawings that I actually did during acting class, during a, an exercise we were doing. And um, then I actually started drawing vapor for my 2D visual effects class. So up here is like some smoke, like cigarette or incense smoke. And this is kind of the same thing right here. Then I've got some steam from an iron and like a geyser. And some more smoke, vapor stuff. So up here, up here's some more incense cigarette smoke and over there too. Um, up here is kind of like a misty volcano that I tried to um, draw successfully, but I don't think it really turned out as awesome as the picture looked. And uh, this is like a factory pipe blowing out smoke thing almost like a smokestack and then this <laughs> this guy this guy is actually a couple of um volcano ash clouds like there was a bigger one right there and then there was a smaller one right here and once i started shading the clouds it started looking like a face and so <laughs> i i drew his face in there and then i put underneath um let's see I saw it and it couldn't be unseen because once I started shading it, I just it I uh, I couldn't stop seeing that face. So I was like, I have to draw it, and I did. Alrighty, more smoke over here at least, and then some quick gesture drawings just for practice, and then my last page of smoke. There we go. Then over here was like a storyboarding study that I tried to do, but it sucked so bad, so I ended up redoing it. Um, but that will come later. Uh, so this guy down here, uh, he actually spawned from the song that I've been working on for the past couple weeks. Um, and I think he also spawned a little bit from Battleship of all movies. I watched that last weekend with my parents and he just kind of popped into my head when I was listening to the song that I wrote so there's him and he's actually up here too getting shot in the face which is terrible but um, then there's my little cat Pepper he was sleeping by me so I thought I would sketch him and I have to go faster oh my gosh I'm taking up so much time um, so yeah, guy smoking, practiced to smoke a little bit and then drew a crazy lady who's asking you if you want to soda pop um, she says, you thought it was beer, didn't you? And there's this guy that's like, give me the soda! And a cute little puffy coat girl thing. And then this picture is really weird, but I really like it. Dun, dun, dun. I don't know why I like this, but I do. <laughs> um, it is a little bit anime esque in the way that I drew it, in the way that I shaded it. And I've been trying to steer away from that, but I just enjoyed drawing it in that style, so I did. And then lastly but not leastly is my actual storyboarding study. I watched a clip from Tales of Varietti and just drew I like had to pause the movie and I would draw the scene that I saw and it kind of gave me an idea of what the storyboards would have looked like. And there's the second page of it. 
And there you have it. There's all my art stuff. So, yes, that is what I've been up to lately. And, um, whoa, falling out of my chair. <laughs> Uh, oh my goodness, I've already taken 10 minutes again. I'm so sorry I took up so much time with these videos, but I really do appreciate you watching them, and I hope that it was informational in some sense. Um, I hope you all have a wonderful President's Day weekend, and I will be updating you again soon on stuff that I'm doing. So, thanks again for watching, and I'll see you guys again soon. Bye-bye!